Hello, I'm Mike from musicradiocreative.com. In this video, I'll show you how to do a pitch shifted stutter in the multi track that sounds like this the best music. So it's really easy to do something like this, especially if you've got my Adobe Audition presets, the exact presets I use to produce audio every day. Grab them at mrc.fm slash presets. So uh, you can just wiggle around this automation line and create something different. The b b best music. You can pitch stutter in any direction you want, but how is this effect actually working? Well, to explore this, let's start a new multi-track session without any presets, and we'll set it up from scratch. So here is a multi-track session, no presets or effects on here. So I'm going to drag in the, uh, the voice I just did. Drag that in now, have a listen. The best music. No processing on it, so I'm going to turn it up a little bit more. The best music. Okay, there it is, and we want to do the pitch shift stutter, so I'm zooming in here on track one, and I'm adding an effect here. It's going to be under time and pitch, the pitch shifter. Okay, pitch shifter going on the effects rack of track one, like that. Close that down, and then pop open this triangle over here. It's a tiny little triangle over to the left of your track one. That'll pop down your automation envelopes. Now pitch is not shown by default. You can do this by opening up show envelopes. You can look for the pitch shifter that you've just put onto your track effects there. Transpose ratio and there it is that nice purple line. Now we can start having fun as we uh, go through make an edit on this and let's do some stuttering on the best. So I'm just going to copy this and paste it in multiple times so we get a stutter first of all making sure to make it nice and even. There we go. And that'll sound like this. Music. Okay, now we've got the pitch up at two, so let's turn that all the way down to one, which will be neutral. B -b best music. And then we simply zoom, let's zoom right in on this and right in on this track. We simply grab that purple line and we move it up to where we want it to be. So something like this, that's perfect. And then we'll play it back. Let's have a listen the best music. So that's uh, pitch shifting from top to bottom, but we could go from bottom to top like this. The best music. Or we could do a wiggly pitch shift like this just by doing something completely nuts and seeing how it comes out. Let's have a listen. The best music. And if you want to make it smoother, you just right click and you click spline curves and you get a nice curve like that. The best music. Much smoother pitch shift, but it's all possible really easily in the multi track by inserting the pitch shifter effect on the track you want and then opening up your automation here and uh, having a mess around sticking on envelopes and moving this line about to get your desired pitch shift stutter. I hope you enjoy using this effect. Let me know how you're using it and what you'd like to see on my channel in the future related to Adobe Audition and audio editing in the comments to this video. Ooh.